An exciting celestial event unfolds Saturday across the country, an annular solar eclipse. CBS2 meteorologist Vanessa Murdoch spoke with NASA officials about what to expect. The spectacle created by the moon blocking the sun, unforgettable. These images captured during the total eclipse of August 2017. The Big Apple, not in the path of totality then, but 70% still well worth waiting in line for. My mind is absolutely blown. An annular eclipse in June of 2021 crafted red devil horns at sunrise, and as the sun rose above the horizon, it resembled a crescent moon. Wow. Saturday, another annular eclipse, also known as a ring of fire eclipse, will delight millions across the country, brighten social media feeds, and mark the start of heliophysics big year, says NASA's Patrick Kane. 14 months or so of, of really exciting events, uh, starting, of course, with Saturday's eclipse. The path of totality Saturday runs from Texas through Oregon. Locally, the moon gradually eclipses about 25% of the sun between noon and 3. I'm excited about Saturday's event, um, but I'm not excited about Saturday's weather prediction. American Museum of Natural History astrophysicist Jackie Faraday says the worst thing you can do to an eclipse is put a cloud anywhere near the sun. Well, your first alert weather team is forecasting clouds and then some Saturday, but no problem for eclipse enthusiast George Aronson. So were you bummed out when you saw the forecast? No, I could always watch it on uh, online. Unfortunately, these glamorous glasses won't get much use this weekend, but don't bury them too far back in the closet. You'll need them again on April 8th of 2024. The one that everybody should be marking their calendars for, because that one is a total eclipse. And the second big event of heliophysics big year. There's just something, there's something deeply human about it. From Central Park, Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. It's pretty exciting, but we'll be watching it online. Yeah, we will. <laughs> and let's hope April's weather is good. April showers, right? April 8th. No, that's the thing. <laughs> that's well. a bigger event come April, yeah. yeah. All right. Um, I've got plenty of friends who chase totality all over the world. When these things happen, they go all over looking for this sort of thing. And, I mean, we, we had one here not that long ago, if you remember. remember. And remember, remember. You remember walking outside, everybody's got their glasses on. And it's like work came to a stop in New York City at that point in time. <laughs> Pretty cool. It all goes dark.